Excited for some Mega Man today, boys. <clears throat> we'll start here in just about a minute. Less than that, probably. We got some cool Mega Man games planned after this. Or a cool one. I'm gonna go slightly in release order, but just for the classic style games. So, uh... We'll do actually Mega Man 5 on the Game Boy next. Which is supposed to be pretty cool, but pretty unknown. <laughs> um, but it's all new shit. It's supposed to be pretty decent content. It'd be kind of cool doing like black and white, you know, Game Boy games. So. Um, we'll be doing that, and then after that, it'll be 8. And then Mega Man and Bat Base. Um, I guess. I think 8 came out, and then Base came out uh, afterwards, but in Japan. We're gonna play the Japanese version. Oops. Shit. Fucking missed all that, man. One sec. Let's go back there. Down, 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 down. Fucking reload the game, dude. It's fine. But yeah, um, so I'm pretty excited to try the Game Boy one. <clears throat> It'll be more in the style of 1 through 6. But, uh, I think it'll be cool. And then 8 will be PS1. I think is when that released. And then... Um, it's actually Mega Man and... Base is on uh, the SNES, so I guess they released a SNES game later on. In the West, it was released on the Game Boy Advance, but no point in playing it on that one. We could play it on the SNES, so it won't be in English, but it's alright. Oh yeah, Rocky, you got some free time today. What's the uh, what's the plan? What game are we playing then? Yeah, five, cool. <clears throat> do you play solo or do you have like a squad? Right on, dude. Oh. Every 17 replay, dude. You can suck this fucking nut. What the fuck, dude? He slid into me, man. Got up. What the fuck? Yeah, this boss will never not be hard. Alright, we need to just game over. Boss is like ridiculously hard. So the final boss in this is apparently notoriously difficult. He's one of the hardest bosses in the entire fucking series. <clears throat> he looked pretty fucking hard, that's why we stopped playing. I knew it wasn't gonna be quick. But uh, I didn't realize he was like that crazy. So we're probably gonna be on this game for a while. Sadly, you have to fight 100 other bosses before you can get to them, so it's also very punishing. Well, hopefully once we beat him, that's it then. Not looking forward to it. Thanks for the, uh, 17 fucking months, man. Thanks, boss. Boss. This boss is ridiculous right here, though. <clears throat> I 
That's what it says, doesn't it? All the classic style ones. I'm not gonna play X or anything for a while. Boss is fucking ridiculous, man. If this boss was easy, it'd be a lot better, but... What am I supposed to do? You get, like, stuck in the goop, man. I wish the goop just instantly disappeared. That would make it a lot better. Yeah, well, we're gonna devolve after this one. I need a game over. I mean, I guess I could keep trying to go, but... I mean, I don't want to go to the final boss with one life left. Oh, I did look something up, because I figured I was missing something on that boss. You can apparently charge the W coil. It's not supposed to... It's supposed to be like the only way you can even kill the fucking final boss, really. Realistically, so... It's one of those things, one of those gameplay things, I don't feel bad about looking up, because I didn't even know you could do it. Street Fighter X Mega Man. Okay, I don't want to be stuck inside of this guy's balls, dude. <laughs> Jesus Christ, man. But he kept knocking me back into himself and then he'd walk a little farther and then I'd be still inside of him. I always hate when a boss is weak to a shield. They did send me 11, but I'm not going to get to it right away because I've got other games in release order to play. So still I'm going to do uh, Mega Man and Bass and Mega Man 5 on the Game Boy before I get through 10. But they did send it to me. I should be able to finish it and get it back before Smash, so... Won't be a big deal. Yeah, I'm not buying Smash. I know it would be a waste of money for me. spend it on anything man. That's the tricky thing with sales is they make you buy things you normally wouldn't buy. Exactly, good, huh? It's one of the best parts about the bosses, and that's why when some guy doesn't have like some huge reaction to something, I feel like there's a different weakness and then you find it. Even if the damage is decent. Yeah, the bosses in this are great. Or the uh the robot masters, it's the best part. They're better than any of the other ones in the series, but I'd say, <clears throat> but the Wily bosses is usually lacking, and Wily himself's just downright way too fucking hard. It's not even like I don't even know what they were thinking on that. For him being at the end of a boss rush and having a phase before him, it's very fucking hard. <laughs> Break Wily. A 
love that boss man. It's nice and easy. They do some good things on this. I think the Robot Master stages are decent. They're maybe not the best stages in the series, but I do like all the ways your items can interact with the environment. I think the secrets are a little much. I think exploring a lot in like a core Mega Man game is not really something you do a lot. So having a lot of hidden shit like that's kind of whatever. The hidden shit's useful, but it's not like crazy useful. I mean the bolt. And the adapt armor is what's useful. I mean, you get to see an extra fight if you get the proto shield, but... I mean, I guess these are useful. I mean, half of the shit's useful. Half of it's like, whatever. They only have one life, so... <clears throat> I'm just hoping to get some practice on the boss. Trees left. Well, you get a free one of these every time your game over, so let's go ahead and use it. And not getting it. There's a lot of other shit out there now that they're done supporting it after the Arden DLC. It's just kind of like. If I'll replay it. That leaves a bad taste in my mouth like they just didn't finish it, you know, finishing it essentially. The best, the best. Sell Hitman, work on Tomb Raider, and stop making Deus Ex. They're definitely uh, throwing away a lot of their stuff. still really hard to not get hit on. <clears throat> this is why I like another life on this one. I need to find a less greedy way to do that. Problem is, like, you want to get over there before he starts dipping. When he dips down, it's really hard to get underneath him. And that's usually about when I want to go over there. This is an insanely hard boss here. This thing's ridiculous. I didn't know you could do this. You could charge it. I think if you hold up on the button, like 
Goes higher? Yeah. Now I guess I could like... The hardest robot master? The slash man dude. By, by far. In this game? Or a total? Total... I don't know. Of everybody. This guy, the Slash guy is pretty close, but the guy who looks like Wolverine, he's been the most inconsistent. I've, I've fought him a million times and I still lose half the time. My tankies. Dive Man. I'm trying to remember Dive Man. The name's very familiar. Jesus, dude. Boss is just unreal, man. Not dodging any of these is like super fucking hard. Okay, I think I remember having trouble with Dive Man a bit. Oh my god, charge. Oh, he's out. Fuck, oh, man. I don't want to miss a single ounce of damage. I'd have to look up a picture of Dive Man after this. <clears throat> look at that shit, it just like re-fucking worked itself to destroy my ass. Like even when you dodge one, man, you're not dodging them all. I'm just hoping through sheer power of tanks, man. And trying to just get hit by the lightning one instead of everything else. Ugh. Which one's next? Mega Man 5 on the Game Boy. I think that actually came out before this, but I didn't know that. So we would have played it before this, actually. No dead kid. <laughs> I was close to being dead. Alright. Well, I'm glad that now I know you can do the charge attack on that. I'm gonna do what I should have done years ago, boy. <laughs> this is slow fucking scroll. I am more than a robot. <laughs> Die, Willy. Fucking Wily, dude. Jesus. Jesus, my man just got a fucking girder slammed on him. I like how Mega Man had all intention and all intent to kill him, man. I 
come in not living anymore. <laughs> yeah, dude, why is fucking... Fucking not. He was about to get murdered, man. I thought that uh, Mega Man was gonna save him, but he just goes for the kill. He's gonna go for the kill, man. Look at this fucking... Look at this fucking alpha explosion behind him, dude. Holy shit. Kino, dude. Um, I do some stuff on the official hardware illusion, but not everything I can. Like Mega Man 5 on the Game Boy, I'm gonna have to do through an emulator. But uh, I got 11 coming in the mail. And then we'll end up playing uh, 9 and 10 off the Wii, Wii Shop. But this one's on emulator. Just walking, dude, yeah. Badass, man. It's badass, man. I mean, fucking look at him, dude. He was just about a straight fucking murder fucking Wiley, dude. He should, man. I'm more than a robot. Fucking Kina, dude. Of course we beat the guy first try when I come back. I should have just tried to do it last night. I didn't know about the bouncing bombs. I gave you just enough damage where I could just fucking use tanks. I don't think I ever dodged a single orb. Like, I did, but I never dodged, like, a full attack. Pattern. This would be an annoying one to no damage. But yeah, since I'm gonna play Mega Man and Baz base on the Japanese version, that's not in any collection. Cause the only thing that came out in the West is uh, the Game Boy Advance one, which is supposed to be shittier. Can I do that? Look at him. But I don't think Mega Man 5 on the Game Boy ever came out on anything except the, the Game Boy. Rockman and Forte, yeah. That's, what, that's the one we're gonna play. Won't be translated, but it's supposed to be the better version. Yeah, for sure. We'll get to X. Um, I'll probably take a little break in between the classics and the next, but I definitely want to do them. There's eight X games, and there's like the extreme games. Two of those, and then there's like the Z, and then there's like ZX and shit. And then of course the shit that isn't platformers anymore, like Legends and Battle Network. I saw Frizz playing Legends last night. That the Wily scene was different somewhere. Oh really? Maybe they changed it. And it hit me. I was about to kill him. Made him seem way more uh, hardcore. If we went in release order, we would be playing Legends soon. But I don't want to do that. I want to just kind of like do a type of game. At a time. And the Street Fighter X Mega Man, I, I just grabbed that. That's free online. It's a fan game, but the reason we're playing is that it's officially sponsored. And like Capcom actually put time into developing it with them, so it's more it seems more official. So I figured, why not? I'm not gonna just play random fan games. I did it with Synchronicity Prologue. Figure we could do it with the Mega Man. And then we'll play Powered Up as well, which is a remake of the first game, which could be cool. We'll probably do that near the end though. That's on the PSP. I guess it has two new bosses as well. Mega Man looks so mean there, man. I'm more than a robot. 
What is the, what do they do in Japan then? He's not gonna murder him in Japan. Thank you for playing. What are you playing now? Uh, Mega Man 5 on the Game Boy. Yeah, I like how the West's Western one gets the violent one. Did they keep him violent in the Legacy Collection? 